In this video, I want to show you how you can take your custom URL for your mobile app right here and you can apply it to what we call a vanity URL, which means for my marketing pieces, I'm going to use app app.jteamfl.com and I put that on all my marketing and that is just going to forward to our KW app. That way no one has to worry about a special code. My code has an I in it, which is not a number one, but it looks like a number one. So this just makes it easier for my clients to find it. So I'm going to do this with Google domains. The concept works the same if you're using GoDaddy. However, I'm going to go to Google domains and I pulled up my domain, which is jtmfl.com. And I own this where I pay them a annual fee of like 12 bucks a year and I get everything with this. So I'm going to come to DNS, which is where we're going to come to a section that's going to tell us synthetic records. But we're really looking for what's called a subdomain forward, which means I'm going to have it go app.jtmfl.com and have it forward to my mobile app link. So I'm going to copy the link from here. Now I've already done this record, but I'll show you what I did. I simply said subdomain forward app and then I put the link here I made sure it was a permanent redirect I left everything else alone because it's just a it's just forwarding to it so the app web page itself is already HTTPS I don't need to enable anything special hit add and that's all I had to do takes a couple minutes and what this means is now on my marketing pieces I just put app jtmfl.com and when you go to that link it just forwards you directly to my mobile app page that makes it easier to put on my business cards, my flyers, all kinds of great marketing pieces here by just having that name. I've already got a piece that I designed in designs. Here it is, and because of this, now I just have app.jtmfl on all of my postcards that I'm sending to my neighborhood. So nice and easy, once you get into there, if you're using GoDaddy, it's the same concept. You get to GoDaddy and you're looking for the DNS settings so that you can do a forward of what they call a subdomain. And that's where you're gonna do app dot your name or your website name dot com or whatever you want it to be. It's your choice. Um, you can use that for anything, not just the app, but this is the easiest way I did it for the mobile app. Hopefully that helps you with forwarding your website name for your mobile app here to a vanity URL like app.jtmfl.com and that's going to help it and make it easier for your marketing. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a like. Leave me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And as always, follow me on YouTube and KW Connect today.